Wimbledon crowd saw a sweeping victory for the USA in the Whiteman Cup against a very gallant but outclassed British team. Hopes ran high for the first match, with America's leading light, Pauline Betts, meeting Jean Bostock. But right from the start, America set the pace in no uncertain manner, and Miss Betts was the winner 6-2, 6-4. Now Kay Mingis meets Margaret Osborne, another American player with terrific attacking power and a deadly service. Here again, Britain was forced onto the defensive in a game which ended in a 6-3, 6-2 American victory. Doubles brought more fast and exciting play, with Miss Betts and Miss Hart meeting Mrs. Passingham and Miss Lincoln. In spite of great efforts, the British girls were unable to stand up to the non-stop attacks of their opponents, who beat them 6-1, 6-3. second day and the deciding match between Louise Brough for the USA and Joan Curry for Britain, who made a magnificent effort to stop the story of defeat. But once again, the American technique piled up the points for an 8-6, 6-3 win. Yes, for the tenth time, the Whiteman Trophy has gone to the USA. And in the presence of Mrs. Whiteman herself, the American captain, the cup is presented by the Duchess of Kent to a very fine transatlantic team. Thank you.